Hi guys, welcome to Warrior Wednesday. I'm Heidi Selman, I'm from Wilmer, Minnesota, and I'm on the women's basketball team. I consider home um, partially split, <laughs> if that's okay, between Minnesota and Idaho. Uh, I was actually born in Idaho and lived here, well, not here, but in Post Falls until I was six. And then uh, my family moved to Nebraska for five years and then we moved to Minnesota where I lived for 10 years before coming back out here. So I think both Idaho and Minnesota hold a special place in my heart. My favorite car to drive uh, is my dad's 1984 Volkswagen Rabbit that I had when I first started driving. And if you don't know what it looks like, you have to look up a picture of it because it's such a cute little car. And uh, it was stick shift and diesel, no AC, had to roll the windows down. And it was just really fun. And it was uh, definitely the only rabbit in the area. So it was pretty notable everywhere I went. Everybody knew it was me, but it was really fun. Some of my nicknames, um, one of the ones that sticks out that's really near and dear to me, I guess, is Heidi Ho. Uh, my papa always called me that when I was growing up. So much so that when I was in kindergarten and asked what my name was, I literally thought it was Heidi Ho. <laughs> and so I love it when people call me that. And then one of my other ones that's kind of notable, my basketball coach from high school gave me the nickname Spongy. Um, because I absorb what my coaches tell me <laughs> and uh, so it was pretty funny when you're running down the court and you made a mistake and you're being yelled at SPONGY! <laughs> so that was kind of memorable in high school and then I think right now a lot of my teammates just call me Hides and I like that too. Simple. <laughs> I love having my little brother at school and uh, I want to consider him little sadly anymore. I always thought I'd be bigger than him but inevitably. Um, but I honestly can't picture it without him here anymore. It's so fun to run into him randomly. I mean he comes over to my house too and we hang out. But just seeing him in the training room and our little jokes that we have and the hugs that we're able to give each other when we need him most. It's been really special to have him here and I'm so glad he is. The best part about being a warrior, I've learned as I've been here multiple years now, is just building the community that you have and you inevitably kind of get. Um, I guess for me, a lot of it has been <laughs> helped by being in the training room a lot, recovering from an injury. I've met really great people and worked with really great people to help me get to where I am today. And that's a big part of the community I have here, along with just the support group and the friends and the teammates, coaches, even just coaches from other teams too. It's just really special, I think, the accessibility, I guess, that we have as warriors and the tight-knit, small atmosphere that we have that we're able to kind of thrive in, at least for me. So I really appreciate that. Uh, Amua downtown, it's a Hawaiian place, super fun. Probably going to state with my high school team. It was the first time, it was my senior year, and it was the first time our team had made it in like 10 years, and so it was pretty, pretty special for our team and community. My dream job, um, I don't really know, because I just like a lot of things, but if I were to choose something right now, it would be to become a professor in biology because that's where I'm getting my degree in and to be teaching somewhere on the coast where there's mountains and ocean and uh, just people because I love people so yeah. Um, I decided to pick up Spanish again this year which I had taken it up until my junior year in high school and it's been really fun actually. I think it's just something special to have and unique and uh, also useful because I would love to travel. Um, and it's also been fun because Taryn and I have been working on it together and we'll have lunches every week and speak in Spanish with each other and that's kind of just a fun little thing we do and a good memory, so. Um, what makes me mad, <laughs> I would say when Luke triggers me <laughs> because he knows how to make me annoyed. Um, but other than that, probably, I don't know, just the typical like when people are disrespectful 
in a really rude way. I'm just like, oh, why, why? Come on, you're better than that. <laughs> Go-to snack is anything with peanut butter. <laughs> uh, so like dipping fruit in peanut butter, that's apples, bananas, that's my go-to snack. Probably the Lynx. They're pretty good in the WNBA. <laughs> I would like to live, um, my qualifications I guess I should say, are mountains, ocean, and four seasons, which is kind of hard to find, but that would be the ideal place. I don't really know where yet, but I'm up for exploring. <laughs> my favorite TV show is called The Midwife. I don't know. Sausage? <laughs> I like sausage on my pizza. <laughs> Thanks for watching Warrior Wednesday.